What's crackling codelets? In this video, I'm going to show you how to connect to MySQL in your Node application whenever you're using GORM IDE. So you're inside of your project folder and you're inside of app.js and you've already included MySQL, var MySQL is equal to require MySQL and you set up your connection here. Now your user, you probably used your username or whatever you thought your username was, but in this case, you should use root instead of your username. So go ahead and put root as the user. And if you set a password, whenever you are installing MySQL and setting it up, then you're gonna have to use that password. Now we don't wanna just put in the password for everyone to see, because that could cause problems, right? But this is how you put it in. So if you just wanted to test it out, you could put it there. However, what we can do is we can export the password into what's called an environment variable. So down here, inside of your project folder in the terminal, you can do export, and then the name of the environment variable. We'll just call this one MySQL underscore PW. Notice that it's all in caps, and then I set it equal to whatever my password is. So once you have that typed out, just hit enter. It's not gonna give you any response on the next line, it's just gonna return to the next line, and that's a good thing, that means it worked. So up here, where we have this string version of our password, we don't wanna leave it that way. So we're gonna do instead a process.env dot, and then here's that environment variable, MySQL underscore PW, all caps. So now we have our user set to root, our password set to an environment variable that is exported as our password, and now whenever we connect to our node application, it will connect to the MySQL database. Of course, you wanna make sure that MySQL is running in the background. So you're gonna do a sudo service MySQL start. That'll get it running. And now from within your project folder in the terminal, you can run node app.js and it should give you some results here. In this case, it's just giving me back the total count of the users in my IG clone database, which is 100. That's how you connect MySQL to your Node application in Gorm IDE. If this video is helpful for you, please like it, subscribe, share it, and we will catch you in the next video. Thanks a lot.